What's up everybody? This is Tony with Just Start Fishing. I hope everybody's doing well. I know it's been three months. It's been exactly three months since I made a video or I'm trying to make a video today, but it's really, really hard. I've had a lot going on. New location, new place, as you see in the background right here. All new places. So this ought to be interesting. Just that way, about a half a mile, was a Civil War skirmish. I don't know if it was a skirmish. They laid there, they walked through there. I don't know, I just know troops went through there. The troops was there. But so I come over here, see what I find, you know? This is a different location of the park. This, this is actually a really, really big park. And the only reason I'm over here is because of that. But I've been here since about eight o'clock this morning. And you know, I really found that. And I found trash, I found can slaw, because it, it's, this is where everybody fishes right here. So, you know, you're gonna find your trash. But finally, Finally, I moved to a new location just across the creek. I found something interesting. I'll show y'all here in just a second. I'll see y'all later. Like I said, I was digging right there, or swinging, I should say. I got about a, between a 15 and 17 on a Knox 600. And I got me an old valve stem. I've only found one other before. That was definitely a first for me. Or not a first, I should say. Actually, it is. It's the first with the with the Knox. So I figured I'd show you. I'll get it more cleaned up when I get home. All right, we'll see y'all later. What's up, everybody? This is Tony with Just Dirt Fishing. I hope everybody's doing well. It's been a little while. I'm out here. You see right in the background right there. I'm in a park, but right here where I'm at had a, a, an old house. It was here until 1970. Uh, behind me, about 100 feet, there's another house on the old maps. So I'm in this spot. The house is right up on the hill. I'll show you in just a second. But this is my second hole. I've been here maybe 10, 15 minutes. I just got me a first. I've never dug one before. This is the first for me. And I didn't expect to find this in a park, but now that tells me there was a house, there was a house here that the pictures won't line. Uh, so it may have been older than the turn of the century, but who knows? But I'll flip, cause I'm on my cell phone. I gotta, I'll flip you around. I'll come back to you and uh, I'll show you what I got here in a second. All right. As I was talking, the house was right, right up on the knoll right there, right up on that little hill. Somewhere in that area right there, which I'm making, I'm making my way up that high. But you know, so you got some pretty, pretty, pretty old trees. But like I said, the house is right there, and I'm coming down swinging. And look what I just pulled out. It rang up about a 17 on the on the uh, not 600. So that's the first for me. I never got one like that. I never got an axe head. Period. So that was the first, figured I'd show you. All right, on to the next. So I might have some good luck this morning. Might be able to get y'all a video. If y'all see this, you know I did. All right, see y'all on the next one. I'm back again. As you see, I got one hole there and I'm still looking for the item there. But that hole right there was just a couple inches of ground. It was kind of a mid-tone. I figured I'd dig it because it won't very far deep down. And like I said, I'm at the old home site and I could pull up this. And lock on something right there. If you know what that is, let me know. This is an old piece of equipment. Something for equipment. Alright, figure this show you. Let me know. Alright, bye. Oh, I'm back everybody. You can see right there in the ground. It won't be about maybe two inches. I'm making my way up towards the house. Where the house sit. I'm swinging along. Got this kind of about 17, 18. I figured I'd dig it and see what it is. Cause I'm getting closer and closer to the house. I'm going to pull out that. Could that be like a, a tack for a horse? Uh, what do they call them? Ring tack or something like that for the horse? Whatever they call it. I can't, I can't remember what they call it. But if you know, let me know. Figured I'd show you. It's definitely a kind of iron and farm equipment day. All right, we'll see y'all on the next. Ah, 
Hey everybody. I'm on the back side of the, I think where the house was because I think I found the driveway which is right behind me. I'll show you here in a minute. I can see it going through. So it must have went on up through the park which I'm going to trace that and find out exactly where it went or get an idea where it went. But I'm on the back side of the house right there in that hole you see it ain't spectacular. It ain't much but it's something you know. There's an old hinge probably get it back working if I took all the rust off of it, but I ain't gonna waste my time on that. But I figured I'd show you. It's something old. Still, still tells me there's a house here. So hopefully there's some coins here. I'm gonna pick this place apart. It might, it'll take me a while, but I'm gonna do it. Good morning, everybody. This is Tony with Just Dirt Fishing. You know who I am. This is a couple of days later. That's the last clip you just saw. I'm sitting here. I'm, I'm found out looking on the map some more. There's another house over in this area. So I'm kind of in between the house I was at on the other clips and then, uh, and then you know, the house I found. I'm kind of in between. And this is probably nothing, but I'm not 100% sure. If you know what that is, I'll take some still pictures of it so you can really look at it. it. Like I said, it may be nothing, but if you know, let me know. All right, see you on the next one. Bye. I'm back again. I'm out here in a muddy mess. I'm down here in the flat bottom of the, where the house set. And we, we had a nice old rain all day yesterday. So this ground is nice and soft and muddy and wet. But about 16, 17, about six inches down, I managed to pull out a piece of a cap gun. You can see it right there from design right there. But I don't check the hole because there's some signals going off in the holes to the south. So I'm going to check it out. And if I can find anything else, I'll get back to you. See you on the next. Hey everybody, I'm back again. I had to come, I come up on the hill and I believe I'm right here in the driveway like I said the other day. But right here, I you to see this. Thirty six, thirty seven, thirty eight, and it's right below the surface. So I figured I would bring y'all along to see what it is, because that's a really, really, really good signal, and it's right below the surface. So we'll see. Hopefully it's something good. Well, that was the culprit. Oh! As you saw, it rang out really, really good. Got some threads on it, so it's hard telling what it is. I'll clean it up. All right, let's see y'all there. You know you're on a home site when you find some old iron, things like that. Somebody needs a drain, or your shower, or your sink. I got one that looks like more like shower. But I'm finding burnt, like burnt wood uh, in the holes, charcoal and stuff like that. So they either burnt the place down or it burnt down or it's just where the dump pile was. But I'm going to keep a plucking away so there got to be something good out here. 
but I figured I'd give you a laugh. It might need a drain. I got one. See you on the next. Hey everybody, it's been a little while since I found anything kind of worth filming, but I'm coming along about where I was the other day, and uh, right there in that hole right there, ain't nothing special, just an old spoon, it's got multiple colors on it for some odd parent reason, so I don't know if they used it for paint or what, I'm not sure, there ain't no markings on it, so it's probably just a regular old spoon, but I figured I'd show you. See y'all the next. What's up, everybody? You know who I am. I hope you enjoyed this video. It's been a while. It's been a couple months. I've had a lot going on. Been busy. New town. So, new places to explore. I'm only on this part because... It's got one, two, three, I think four houses on it. And maybe more, because I seen an old site the other day when we were walking through the pass. But, uh, you know, hope you enjoyed it. I ain't found no coins. I did find a nickel and a penny, but they were kind of newer. But that's about it. I mean, I'm not hitting no top lights. I'm hitting all the home sites. So you just never know what you're going to find because you don't know how they got tore down or if they burnt down or whatever. But, uh, it is what it is. See you on the next.